morning everyone a little bit better time today than the last time i'm after i put some oil down here somewhere and i've i've lost it because what i'm gonna do actually one more go won't be enough i'll tell you what i'll sit you down first and we'll have a chat the plans for the day because we're supposed to be going for a nice big long walk up the uh, Simon side circuit somewhere near Rothbury there's a there's a walk up there it's on my phone I've got it all kind of downloaded but there's some sort of like tractor a troop of tractors <laughs> I have no idea what we might kind of end up passing as we get to this walk I've, I don't know but I want to cut the grass and I'm still, I hope you're still kind of collecting for your compost, you know what I mean? So the, the end goal is to get up to the allotment. <laughs> Did you have a little bit in there? Because um, Paul's brought over some more rubbish. Yeah, I'll show you down. Paul's been a good lad there. And also, I'm cutting this wood into kindling. That's the, I'm just going to just chop swords and just miss out them nails. That's another job for us. But Paul's brought up some more compost. In, can you see, you can see there, but it's all cut grass. Now I've got cut grass, are you there? Me, oh, it's, all, it's going to silage, but it's not yet, so it's still got that sweet smell. So if we just go through, I'll show you what I want to do before the walk. We'll put this up there to stop the bloody dogs. Because the little dog, Ralph, scratches the grass. So it needs, needs cutting this. And this is a shared garden, but I just cut, I've cut it for ages. But my compost bins, for some reason, are all full. Like two, except for this one. But this is just for like household waste there now. And I don't want to kind of just fill it up. So, my last cut, I've just left the grass in, so I'm going to put that straight in there now. That was like full, and it's just within a week went down. I got more wood, these bloody things were heavy. Where's that oil, Tony, man? I can't find this, my bits and bobs, bits and bobs shelf. But I want to show you this. So this, I want, this is my job. <laughs> I'll leave my grass cutter outside. I cover it with a skateboard ramp. <laughs> Even when we had the shed, I didn't have it in. Now that doesn't look pretty. I'll be honest, that is a builder. That thing there cuts like something not right. Honestly, I went to a, I'll tell you the story about that. We had, I had this kind of obviously fancy one that kind of put it went by itself and <laughs> within two years it had rusted and it had kind of the rust had come through the the casing here come through that casing and it was just dropped the bits wheels come kept coming off everything there was an advert on facebook for grass cutters i went this young kid kid puppy he had about 30 in this big lot up and I says, oh, I don't know anything about, he says, take that one. He says, I swear to God, take that one. And that, and it was the ugliest one there. And man, it stays out also. I'm going to, I'm, I'm lining myself up here, aren't I, for a big feel. It stays out all summer and I'll just start in it cuts, just cuts straight away. So let's see if I'm right. Actually, I'll take this down because I want this grass for the compost. Oh, it's heavy. Five little squirts on the little rubber thing. You know what it needs as well, mind you. I haven't put oil in for years. <laughs> That's what I was looking for. First time. Oh, don't let us down. Oh. <laughs> it <laughs> now 
It ain't the prettiest lawns. <laughs> It'll not win any awards for the prettiest lawns. That was... I should just pick it up. It's just stuff that fell over when we're moving all. But anyways... That's one job ticked off. Right. So I think I've got to get ready. We're going to go for this walk and I'll hopefully show you some pictures if we see the tractors. I'm going to come back get up the allotment and cut that wood.
I'll be honest, <laughs> I've, had, I've, had, I've had to have a little lie down after the walk. It was a great day out, lovely, but it's chaffing, but <laughs> quite a bit of chaffing going on, you know what I mean? But I still don't know what them tractors were all about, to be honest. But it's a way late and now it's, <laughs> it's 20 past eight in the evening. Man, so I'm going to take up, because if you remember, that was the grass. I just want to get these bags out up to the allotment and give a little water. So come on. Get up there. Mind, this evening time has got the same kind of morning vibe time, that kind of peaceful, tranquil time. I'm just having a look there at, you know, those veg that I planted. I'll just show you. I think eventually you're not going to see them. Do you know what I mean? Because aren't the things are just going to grow stupidly. So these were the broccoli. And actually, look. Oh, these are the cauliflower. I can't remember. Cauliflower, were they? Getting pecked. The lettuce is all right. But I think things are just going to start. Now, didn't I plant some... I planted something else, but I can't. Am I walking on it? <laughs> I thought I planted something else. And I thought it was down there. Come on, tell us where it is. Anyway, looks like I didn't. I don't think that's moved. Was it down here? What there is though, can you see? Like all this white white flowers, strawberries. Mm -hmm. So that all like all the little white flowers on the ground there, strawberries. I'll be hunting for them, bogus. But anyway, I'll show you this compost and we'll just have a little wait on. Wait, wait, wait. Shh, 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 shh. Look at that. Oh look at Wait, look at this man. Bloody hell, they're getting hammered. I put some pellets down, but look at they were perfect. Slugs and snails. I wonder if there's anything kicking around here now, you know? Ready to pounce. Oh. <laughs> yeah, but look at them bloody. <laughs> we're doing on the the potty mouth chat and Audrey's got a trouble with squirrels and it was <laughs> Audrey, what's the best way to get rid of them Audrey? Shoot them so <laughs> that was far Audrey right, let's get this compost show you what I've got going in so I think it's still so important that keep on filling your compost. Oh, look at that, man. One big clump. Get up there. Just put the water on there. And yes, I can hear it. Didn't I tell you me water pipes busted? So you can hear it. Bloody, <laughs> Bloody hell, man. I don't want to on. I don't want actually this wet. Oh, come on. I'll explain about that in a second or two, but I'll just give things. I'm going to have to just top water. Jeez. I know Ian from Growing Local will be going mad. But just, I'm just going up to water. I've got to touch a, the feed in there, just to water these tomatoes up here. See how things are doing here. They're all getting, let me see there, they're all getting flowers on like, so fruit soon, hopefully. I'm just watering them first, just to wet the ground. I'm going to have to probably start watering up here as well, you know, just looking a tad dry. Let's get these out. These onions aren't going to do anything without a bit of water, to be honest. They're just kind of bunched, bunched in, but... Right. Get that on. 
Oh, look at peas are coming. Where's well, Marge too? It's coming. So that's a plus. I can grow Marge too. <laughs> Let's get this open. There we go. I mean, they'd be all right if I'm honest, but I want some onions. Do you know what I mean? A little bit over there. Just to keep them sweet. There we go. I oh mean, it's, it's so nice, just like, this is why it feels good. This is where the therapy comes from. Just being here. Look at this man as well. Two year old onion sets are away. They're like a miracle of a garden. Do you know what I mean? Then I can show you something that you see. Like, like, two, two days, weeds <laughs> on the other extreme. Or oh, what I think I've got mine, yeah, is Allium leaf miner on a couple of me. Is this, we were talking about it the other day or, or last night. On the, see that? Is that where it's all getting knotted up? Actually, that's a bad one to show you. There's a couple of them on the garlics. There's one. Let's just have a look. I've never had it before. See, does that, I'm going to, see that's just come off of me, and I'm just going to pull that up, to be honest, if I can, oh I can't get it out, now, let's see if there's anything, nothing under there, no bloody bulb on yet, I'll put that in the bin to be honest, like a plastic carrier bag, is that what it is, <laughs> just another thing that I had to the, the I was going to say the misery, and then in the first sentence I'm saying how beautiful life is here. It's getting dark now, and I think you be getting a little bit worried because I've really slipped. I don't want to leave, but I'll be up first thing in the morning. So do join me. In a few hours, I will be here again. Until next time, look after yourself. Take good care. <laughs>